Welcome to Kathy D. Slats SRC for You group Zoom call for May 6, 2021. To access the group Zoom call, we're going to scroll down her website. Look for this banner right here that will take us over to the Zoom platform. Remember this password and click here. We're on the Zoom platform. We will allow. Type in the passcode. And Kathy will open the room just momentarily. Kathy has opened the room. We will join with out video. We will join with computer. Audio. Show you kind of is this has thrown me off today. We were going to go on into the middle San Jao, but we're still working on the lower. And we've been going all this time. So let's let it be. We've got our everything still in there just as it was. And uh, let's just let that go. Um, Tomorrow, hopefully, we'll be ready to go to the middle of San Jao, and then over the weekend, we're going to do the upper and bring back in the dental stress again. And uh, Deb Taylor sent a great tooth chart, and I've been experimenting with that on people, uh, having them not tell me which tooth and then doing the scan, and it's been right on. Really? So, so that'll be, but we have to wait till we're ready. We have to finish this San Jao <laughs> lower. We'll do that first, and that's your involved with the triple burner. And you can see, I want to show you this, um, some of these notes from yesterday. Remember, some of the things we doused in in reference to the San Jao, the triple warmer, how powerful. And we can go in, let's just go in uh, to the recharger. And for now, Let's just put uh, balance and this goes, let's do triple former and just see where we as a group are. Hey, we're taking nine hours. So we see this has got some stress. And uh, in order, if you compare us to a local website and we're working to create the life we really consciously desire, uh, we may not be pulling in the information based on some of these meridians. Now, I also wanted to mention the um, testing we did yesterday in reference to the test swabs and a few things. And I'm getting ready. I'll have a, a protocol for this probably by the weekend. Not We have to understand that the SRC is not necessarily giving a psychic reading. It's saying what we resonate with on a subconscious level. We resonate with that information. So I'm, I'm pulling some information up. It looks like... Um, uh, this damages the epithelium, which in, impacts our mucous membranes. This is what's going in, according to the article, um, hydrogenol and lithium. And what that does, that targets the pineal. And according to the um, article, ivermectin completely dissipates that. Uh, there's also some stress related to red blood cells and blood clots. Well, all I would say is what does it hurt to douse in that information and uh, remember that anything like this, if it were even true, it's working on the uh, matter and the far more powerful is the etheric field. And so that's what we're working with. Also, I talked with a programmer of the SRC. I had to laugh. I had referred to him as the head programmer. He clarified he's the only programmer. And we have it set up. <laughs> we, we have it set up for um, May 23rd here in St. Pete. It's actually way south down, so it's right over the Skyway. For those of you down that direction, uh, he's going to give a wonderful presentation, and it's just $20. Oh, cool. for his time all the way from Arizona. And but I man. spoke with him yesterday about this situation. And of course, that's not new information. We've been hearing for a long time about these test swaps. So it's nothing new, nor do we we can't do the tests ourselves to see. But here's what he said we could do. We we can go as Kevin puts it, we can do a broad brush or we can do a laser. And uh, so here is the broad brush, and I think this is probably just as impactful as the laser. 
So you, if you have, if you've had the test, or those you care about have had the test, and they give you permission, and of course, if you, if it's your kids, you have permission. They say, but let's go in here, and he said, put neutralize any effect from the test swab in my body. Nothing wrong with asking for that. Then you're going to go down here and enhance. Okay, so for this deformities, I like what Deb Jones suggested. Just go, we don't know exactly what that means, but let's just go into the uh, timeline. All time. Just let it run. This would be appropriate because apparently the stress is related to the pineal gland. And um, that that is because the pineal gland is our largest magnetic field. They say, I thought it was the heart actually, so I still have to get updated on that. Let's just see what kind of stress. Well, there's some significant stress. It may not be related to the, the test swabs, but there's some significant stress. Let's just put, just have to type it out again. The reproductive system perhaps is impacted. Hypothalamus, so all the glands, they said all the glands are impacted but uh, in particular, the pineal. Now remember, this is all we have to do. You don't have to go deeper if you don't choose to. Um, okay, defensive act action, I like that. Restitution, we're gonna make it right. Our body has complete self-healing capability. Uh, it does stress out the lymph a little bit. Um, bachelor, the only man who has never told his wife a lie. So <laughs> for some reason, the men are in the doghouse at this point. Um, the liver, gallbladder, stress perhaps, and of course resistance factor trauma. Uh, let's just go in here to the Pro Tools and see what comes up for some Pro Tools to work with. And I have, I went to Office Depot yesterday and yes, the mouse little black thing was in the mouth, so now I just have to play around with it later today. <laughs> so I felt kind of foolish as you. usual. But you see learning now, process. Yep, yep. So here we go. All we're going to do now is we're going to do um, preserve theme and wonder click. And I've been playing around with this. Uh, you can neutralize other things. I got a call this morning, and this is someone saying that she was concerned about biological warfare and she she uh asked if there was anything the src can do well there's anything we can do it it's 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 our human computer but for example let's just do this kathy how come you did the preserve theme on that that's just what ralph said just do i've never seen i've never even Okay. Yeah, I usually will scan every session and say, should we preserve theme or preserve options or do manual? And, and I what, find does, out, what does that do exactly? I don't know exactly, but I know that sometimes we need a little more time on one segment of it. Okay. Yeah. And it seems the results are better. So let's just put, for example, let's just again, we can put the client group, but we, since we are a part of the situation, we can put a state, we can put a country, we can put mankind, and let's just put the theme, uh, stress related biological warfare. 
And I did this on the other computer this morning. I want to see what comes up here. Uh, let's just go ahead and hit enter, which puts that in. Let's um, enhance theme. So here we've got illness and wellness. Unwellness. Blood stain, yeah, illness and unwellness. Nervous system, let's just go in. This is something I do quite a bit during the day. Let's just balance the nervous system. Yes, we do that enough that we're no longer asking for hours and hours. There's the pineal again. So we see we do, if you have the software, it sure doesn't hurt to be uh, recharging the pineal or balancing or whatever comes to you. Uh, there's the lungs we want to focus on. We're doing metal strengthening. Wouldn't hurt. Though no, We'll see what the Pro Tools asks for also. So the defensive action, now this is kind of interesting. Not suppression, which is where you know you're not wanting to think of it, but actual repression where it is so deep that that is we're not aware of it um and it's interesting people a lot of people will say well our powers that be would not do this to us they would not send these energies to harm us uh i don't think so either but there is a great book by hal huggins called in uninformed consent has anybody read that what is it um, uninformed consent that's the name of the book that's the name of the book. And it, it, Hal Huggins is not with us anymore. He was up in years when he wrote the book. But he was not only a dentist, but he was also a, a blood scientist of the blood. And he is the one who brought to light what metal in our mouth does. And he was banned, of course, from the entire dental profession, even though they had the conclusive evidence of what the metal for one thing, the dentists were even going nuts, putting all that metal in. They had the information. They were even taught in some medical schools to not read Al Huggins. They would have whole course wow. segments on it. So uh, in that respect, have we are, are we actually perhaps repressing some of this information, which would mean we wouldn't even know we were doing it? Press related. Isn't that the same way with these uh, uh, the PCR tests and the um, and the um, vaccines, quote unquote vaccines? I mean, people weren't really given the actual um, information on what they were. Exactly right. it's, yeah, it's an experiment, and the FDA has not approved it. And right. I know the FDA gets a lot of slack. But let me tell you right now, a lot of us, depending on our age group, would be walking around with flippers if the FDA had approved thalidomide. They did not. They saved right. many. Absolutely. And they have not approved the vaccination. And the guy, the head guy has said, we will not approve it until we know it does no harm. Right. So all the people that took it is really another piece of uninformed consent. It is uninformed consent, and it's also known as, maybe we should clear that, a viral belief system. Uh, mm -hmm. this, this COVID came out. The numbers indicate less than 1% uh, don't survive it. Um, and it's funny. They're talking about, isn't that funny? We didn't have any flu last year. Many of the cases of the flu were diagnosed as COVID, according to what I've read. And wow. what you have is an ac actual viral belief system implanted maybe through the media, right? scaring people. And so these are all things to think about, not to get all carried away about because there is a solution. Okay, here's what I want to see. Uh, this was the same on the other computer is the stress factor is our digestion. So this is the time to be very aware of what we're eating. This is not the time to eat the, the pint of ice cream every night. Uh, this is an, in, look at this, words to ponder. Always stay 100% behind your boss. 
then it's easier to stab him in the back. That's pretty creepy. I don't know where that came from. Uh, inflexible. Misery. We, again, we don't have to go further with this, but look at this. Social. Um, now, I haven't had the vaccine, and I, I uh, now nobody even asks me anymore if I'm going to take it. <laughs> but there's a lot of social pressure. Let's just look at that. Oh, you didn't get it at all. Oh, no. Absolutely not. Wow. Somebody asked me, they said, what if your daughter came to you and said, Mother, I can't see you if you don't get the vaccine. I said, you're not understanding what I said. I will not get the vaccine. Amen. It's as simple as that. And Amen. I think it may be necessary for us to make a statement. Uh, and, uh, and especially since it's not approved. Right. Yeah, right. I was, I was forced to get it. Exactly. That's why we need a solution. So many were forced in one way or another, and there is a solution, but we have to be aware. It's, it's like we can't look at that truck coming and saying, I'm sure that driver sees us, so I'll just walk right in front of it. We better give some thought. Let's just look um, at stress and social pressure to get the COVID. And this group may not be experiencing this. But let's just see. It would be a negative thing. It's, it's in there. It's not huge, but it's in there. So, and that, that is, look at that, that's the biggest, um, you go to resistance and confliction, that's your, your, your high point. So again, but this, again, we're, I have to backtrack, this is on the biological warfare. This is the stress related, if there is even such a thing. So let's go ahead and preserve that and hit the wonder click. But you can see how it all ties together. Perhaps the COVID is a form of that, I do not know. I am not in a position to know. But what we could do is go in here and let's just for ourselves. <clears throat> clear non-beneficial viral belief systems. Twenty minutes, that's not too bad. Not that bad or good is a factor, but you got what I'm saying. There's not a lot of, in this group, if you're already in the group, you probably already have questioned some beliefs. But also, um, because the dietary has been stressed both on, on the other computer and also here, um, I went ahead and scanned our, and I do this at some point every day. And this, this sustenance balancer is probably underused. So for one thing, you're getting an idea of the yin and the yang of your um, system. All very subtle, but we see hands, stomach, spleen, meridians, feet, multiple meridians. So maybe at that point. And by the way, uh, I have a new price list for the uh, SRC and all the things and it may be a little different from what you're used to. So um, you can subscribe to some of these things very reasonably, like the Pro Tools. So let's just go in here and balance, as we see a lot of meridian stress, all meridians. Taking 13 hours. So you're saying people can rent it for a while? They can subscribe as yes, well. And first of all, also, there's always a free trial. And what's happened is a lot of people that initially started out using the SRC, they're just now getting a feel for it. So, uh, and some of them can't find their stick. It's like, oh, yeah. So um, there are all kinds of things we can do to work with these people if they get in touch. And while uh, we're at it, just for the heck of it, since... Uh, when, I got, when I got my... Uh... SRC, I, I didn't get any any type of whatever thing you call. The dongle, yeah, you can have a link or a dongle, that's right. 
Yeah, I didn't get any. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, some people have a stick, some don't. Now, while we're in here, um, let's go in again and see how we're doing with that root chakra. Even though we looked pretty good yesterday, that's still, um, let's just look at balance. We're going to be moving up the chakra system. It's 10 minutes, so see what we did. Did it does appear that it, it held? So let's go ahead now and balance. Let's look down Would here. that be a, a good thing to do when you it just can't balance somebody's aura? To me, it would, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I tell you, I was, I was working on somebody the other day and it, I just could not get it to balance. I can't even tell you how many times I ran it. Mm -hmm. I finally ended up uh, doing the emotions and um. Mm -hmm one of the other ones to try and balance some things out. Did it do it? Um, I had it running through the night and I did it the next morning too. It's higher, but not to a hundred. Wow. Not to a hundred. It was interesting. And this is, yeah. This, yeah. yeah it was Lots of times if you can't get the aura to balance, uh -huh. uh, if you put in the sulfagio tones. Ah, um, thank you. Thank you. What is that it? Really what? The solveggio tones, the seven tones yeah. of the body. If you, um, I'm not sure that there's a uh, library or a setup for it, but if you run that, that'll that'll help. That usually balances the aura. There may so, be there may be. So a I'm sorry. What 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 program would you put that in? Uh, you'd put it in as a. Um, uh, yeah, my mind doesn't even think this morning. Put I know sometimes the, I can't think of what's on the Pro Tools. Yeah, put it in as a uh, SRC, as a cocktail. Yeah. And the we may that, have it. Oh, that'd be good because there's seven tones, so it's a hurt. Yeah, here we go. Now this one, I thought I had more. I may have it on the other computer, but here's one, for example, for abundance. Uh, but you could, yeah, you well, as long as just maybe you might have to make your own co cocktail, but it'd be the yep. seven tones. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. All right. That's great. Thank you. Yeah. Just go ahead and, and uh, we'll do that later. So anyway, that it. Thank you. Thank you for that. Yeah, the sophagio are are healing, and uh, can be tied in with everything you do. All right. So let's just balance this. And meanwhile, I did go ahead and do a scan. And this, um, if you have your own list of supplements, you can always add them. I'm, I'm going to add this whole list for the group, but with special emphasis. For example, here's some stress related to scar tissue in the brain from trauma. Let's go ahead and just add that. And these are codes. These are various codes but I found that I really wanted to know what it was for. And uh, so you can add that. This is the nutrient cocktail. This is in the P4 also. And we're asking for that. What is, what is it? The nutrient cocktail. This just has about everything known to man in it for nutrition. And then wow. the system, your system is going to take what it needs. Um, I just, uh, what happens, the way some of these get added is when I'm working on someone, if they come up and say that's how they want that information is through the sustenance balancer, then I'm just going to add it. So there we want the bio shield. So let's go ahead and add that. So you're putting that in uh, all of our... In the, yes, in the bio, yeah. Oh, that's a, okay, I thought that was a gadget. That's a, a product. Uh, disable chemical delivery systems. Yeah, each person will take of this what they need. Oh. I'm just, we're wanting to have our brain cells nourished. I know I can personally use that.
I love that one, Experience the Miraculous. I guess the, the whole point that I would stress today is that we have nothing to fear. We can just realize the power we have. And that means not going into some of this fear. And this is one, I, I bought some rosebud tea. You might want to check that out for yourself. And it comes up all the time. So that's another tea. Here's divine connectivity. That's in our general scan. Remove stress from heavy metals. This is uh, on hearing, healthy habits, healthy hearing. It'll all be in there, but um, this is an interesting release, karmic debt. And they say that is held in the chakras. That's, there's love, that's the essential ingredient. It looks like the dietary, no matter what kind of scan you do, it looks like the dietary comes up as a stress. And then in reference to trauma. Okay, so we've got um, the recharger. Let me just see what we might want to do with that. The thing of it is, Nothing is really good or bad, they say. For example, we got to have some fear. Uh, we got to have some shame if we've done some harm to someone, etc. Um, let's see what we've got in here. How about accelerate healing? Is everybody comfortable with that? Yeah. Sounds good. All right. Yeah. So let's. Yes. Let's put um, clear trauma, even though we may have learned some tremendous lessons. So in other words, like I'm saying, you have to kind of look, look at it that way sometime. I'm going to go down one. Let's do accept self. Okay. 22 hours. So, and then we want the fuel generator. Let's do the same thing with it. I will get this list. I'm, I need to put both computers in sync and get with Kevin and have everything downloaded from one to the other. Just put love in here. Okay, so what kind of cocktail, what kind of field would you like around you today? Um, can you all see this? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. No. I'm just going to be scanning down, but anybody who mentions first, that's what we're going to have. Alignment with higher self. Yeah, that's what I was just looking at. Yay, yep. okay. Alignment with higher self. Again, there you go. So let's see where we are with that. 
20 minutes. And, that, and then that will set up a field for the day. And I don't know why these little things come up like this once in a while. And I have to go in and have Kevin <laughs> fix it. But um, so that is where we are. We've got, um, we're still working on the lower sand gel. We may not have much more time to go. We did go a total of 28 hours on that. So when that finishes, I'm going to go ahead and just put sand gel middle in there. Um, let's get the, see where we are with this. Uh, Kathy. Yeah. What was the, who brought up the, the, um, the idea of the uh, lottery yesterday? Yeah. The idea of what? The, uh, they talked about the lottery. lottery. Oh, <laughs> we have a we have a, a cocktail in there for winning the lottery. Oh, okay, yeah, I remember. Yeah, seeing it, yeah. You know. Are we back to a bazillion dollars in the lottery somewhere? I haven't followed it. I don't either. Yeah, I do have one girl. Uh, I have a few people who are experimenting with these intention statements. And that is Hirsch, but she is already extremely lucky at the lottery. She's a single mother. She's got her hands full. And often she goes when she gets gas and gets a lottery ticket and wins a few hundred. Oh, wow. So it made sense to me. Let me turn this off. Um, it made sense to me since she really does need that financial support to write an intention for us to experiment. So I'll let you know. Cool, cool. So, um, I have a question. Tomorrow, are we going to do, today we did the brush stroke on the, like, UCR. Tomorrow, are we going to do the laser? Or at some uh, point if I can time? get it ready, we sure are. Okay, well, no problem. Yeah, I'll have it ready for sure by the weekend, but yeah, I think, and that's what Kevin said. I said, well, Kevin, maybe, maybe we just need the brush stroke. He said, no, you really, you should do both. Yeah. So, tomorrow, we're going to, uh, or as soon as I can get it ready. Yeah, whatever, whatever. Yeah. Monday is Monday is good. Yeah, no, well, no problem. No, I think I'll probably get you now. I want to show you real quickly too. You see, we cleared. This was um, uh, clear. This was our thirty day five G, and we ended up. Our theme was expiratory, expiratory, but we cleared that. I just wanted to show you that. And then we did increase vibration. Then we cleared that, but a little weakness on the part of the yin organs. Oh, and that's just, I thought we had one more, but maybe not. Okay, this is the neutralize any effect from the test swab. And you see it did go ahead and it, we enhanced, but when we hit the wonder click, then it filled up over here too. All subtle information. The psychic attack is interesting. That may be our own thoughts. There's that finial again, though. Lots of focus on that, so it probably wouldn't hurt. Um, I had a conversation with a guy who could talk your arm off, but he was trying to pull my leg. I think in our group, we may be angry with men today. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's getting a lot of that kind of action, and we do want to start monitoring these thoughts. They're coming from the unconscious, but they're impacting our reality. And the more upset you are with men, the more bad ones you're going to call into your life mm -hmm. or anything. If we're upset over this vaccine stuff, we're going to have a lot more stress related to it. So the idea is to uh, have joy in your own system. And like Carolyn Mace talked about, go up that high rise, increase your voltage and uh, see a different reality. Does that make sense? Absolutely. Yeah. So I guess that's it for today. Perfect. It was great, Kathy. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Kathy. Uh, thanks. Bye. Have a good one. This concludes the SRC for You group Zoom call for May 6, 2021. Thank you for joining. We look forward to seeing you again. Until then, take care and be well.